Okay, big finish here, at least for the investigations part. Um, so, uh, principles and uh, points to emphasize for any kind of investigation. Minimize handling and corruption, possible corruption, of original data. Uh, make sure that uh, you know uh, what you're doing, uh, but you know do as little as possible. Uh, any, you know, remember the chain of custody, uh, the chain of evidence. Remember the fragility of digital uh, forensic data. Um, be be careful and uh, you know just uh, when in doubt don't is, is uh, a good idea in this regard um, account for any changes keep detailed logs of your actions and again you know written logs in terms of what you have done uh, but also um, in uh, a lot of areas, uh, particularly the initial uh, search and investigation of a, a crime scene, but um, in, uh, you know, even uh, doing uh, technically complicated work uh, that will likely need to be defended in court, uh, be uh, prepared to you know, have videotape, uh, you know, probably video of, of the whole thing, uh, including, uh, you know, taking close-ups of the screen to show what it shows, uh, not just for recording purposes, but to, to demonstrate, uh, yes, you did everything properly or as properly as you could. Um, so, uh, again, the rules of evidence know the rules of evidence, comply with the rules of evidence, uh, the principles, um, the IOCE uh, principles there, the, um, uh, uh, remember the chain of custody, um, you know, that's again and again and again, remember the chain of custody, chain of evidence, vitally important. Um, do not exceed your knowledge uh, and that's a, that's a big one. Um, I, I, you know, I keep on saying, get specialists in, get specialists in. Yes, you know, you think you know enough to do this. You probably don't. You certainly haven't got a lot of experience in it. And that will come out in court. You know, somebody's there on the other side. And again, they don't have to prove you wrong. They just have to prove you made a mistake. Didn't know what you were doing. Um, have the security policy have the security policy decided in advance in, in regard to investigations and again um, you know uh, senior management uh, should be deciding this I mean you, you need to sort of present this type of stuff to them to show them how complicated it can be um, but you need a decision um, and you need senior management to be behind you uh, when you are doing the investigation. Uh, you know, this, is, this is the policy. This is what we do. Um, obtain written permission uh, at a number of points, particularly when you are um, contacting outside parties, uh, letting contracts, contacting law enforcement particularly, um, you know, have that documented, you know, that you requested that this be done and that senior management agreed, yes, this, this is the policy, this is what we will do. And particularly if it's not the policy. Uh, so, uh, you know, uh, capture as accurate an image 
of the system as possible. And we talked about, you know, bit image. We talked about the slack space. We talked about, you know, all the different areas uh, that uh, you need to capture and the fragility of all of it. Uh, be prepared to testify. Be prepared to justify to a very hostile interrogator what you have done and why. Uh, so, uh, ensure your actions are repeatable, just like science, you know. Uh, repeatable is the, the keystone of, of science. We did the experiment once and we got this result, but we never got it again. Uh, sorry, no good. Um, be repeatable. And, uh, you know, that goes along with, you know, do not damage, do not corrupt uh, original evidence. Um, so, uh, work fast. Um, you, you are under time pressure in, in a lot of these cases. Um, sometimes the attack is still going on. Sometimes, um, you know, an, an incident is in process. And so you need to um, ensure that uh, you are, are working quickly, but of course, carefully. Uh, you have to ensure that you're uh, uh, minimizing any damage over the time period of the intrusion of the attack, but also um, you have to ensure that uh, you do everything properly. Don't work so fast that you cut corners. Somebody is going to be on the other side of the table when this ends up in court. And it might. Regardless of what it is, it might. Uh, proceed from volatile to persistent or durable evidence. Um, you know, from memory to writing on disk or jump drive to printing it out uh, so that it's more durable and so that it can be proven that nothing was was changed uh, that it hasn't been corrupted um, don't run any programs on the affected system and I mean uh, this is sometimes not possible to be absolute about, but um, the least possible activity on the affected system is preferable. Again, minimize the chance for corruption of evidence, uh, for changing uh, what you are presenting to people. So, quick checklist of do's and don'ts for investigations.